Betty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw a dog for 2018 for the Chinese New Year, Year of the Dog. A shout out to Oxy Ellie and Lime Lovely. Hi, Simply Hi, and Happy New Year. I'm going to take two fingers at the top, in the middle, and put a dot. And then I'm going to draw a curve line up, in, out, in, up, in, over, and stop. Come back to the dot, draw a curve line out, in, out, in, out, in, out, in, and stop. Now I come back on the left and I draw a big curve line down, curve line in, out, in, out, in, out, in, out, up, connect. Come on the right hand side, draw a big curve line out, in, little curve line in, out, in, out, in, out, in, out, up, and connect. Now, all of these little curved lines, they can be any way you want because we're making fur. So if yours look a little bit different, that's fine. Now I come back to the lower left and I'm going to draw a curved line out, in, out, in, and I'm going down. I come back on the right hand side, I'm going to do the same thing. Curve line out, in, out, in, out, in, keep going, and connect, okay? I come back to the left hand side and I'm going to draw a curve line, curve line connect on the left, come over on the right hand side, I'm going to draw a curve line, curve line connect on the right. Come back to the left and draw a little curve line inside, come back to the right, draw another little curve line inside. Come above the left, and I'm just going to do a squiggle. I go curve line, curve line. Come on the right hand side, I'm going to do another squiggle. Curve line, curve line. Doesn't matter how it looks. Right about here in the center. I'm going to do a curve line over, straight diagonal down, straight diagonal up, connect. Right here at the bottom, I put a little straight line, and now Going towards the left, I'm going to do another wavy, curvy line up on the left. Come right here to the straight line on the right. Wavy, curvy line up on the right. Right about here in the center, I'm just going to do a squiggle going down on the left and a squiggle going down on the right. <clears throat> Excuse me. Like I said, there's no right or wrong to this because he is a dog and we are doing fur. Right about center, I'm going to draw one circle, then I'm going to draw another circle around it, and inside I'm going to put two, zero, one, eight. Okay? I come to the left hand side and I'm just going to do wavy line all the way down off the page on the left, come up on the right, wavy line all the way down off the page on the right. I come back to my circles and I draw a curve line up, connect on the left, curve line up, connect on the right. Come back to the left and draw another curve line up, connect on the left, come right over here on the right, draw another curve line up, connect on the right. Now I come back right here to the center and I just draw a curve line down, up, connect, and I put a little curve line inside. Okay, I think that's all. Yes, now we're ready to color. Okay, what's cool about animals is, is that because of their fur, <clears throat> you can double color. But I'm going to start off with it, I'm going to do his nose black. I'm going to do his eyes black, these sections right here. <coughs> Excuse me. Then I'm going to put a little bit of color 
on my face, my ears, bring it down. And I'm using an apricot, but you could use your light brown. This part is his fur all the way down. And it's what I call a scribble scrabble. It doesn't have to be inside the lines or going all the right direction because of this fur. We want it to have a little bit of texture. Once I've done that, <clears throat> excuse me again, I got a cold. I come back over and I do my loop-de-loop -loop line over the first color I just did. So that kind of gives it a double color look. You can use any color combinations you want or not. You can just do your dog all in one color or you could do them in black or make them spotted. It's up to you. But you want a double color the first light color and then go over it with a darker color any color that you choose this right here is part of his neck too then I come in and I'm going to give him a red collar and I'm going to give him a yellow disc so going around my 2008 okay let's see what he looks like all colored in okay here's my dog for the year of the dog, 2018, all ready to go out and celebrate. Okay, bye-bye.